Hotwood Hall College, in partnership with Manchester City Football Club and City and the Community, is offering a new Level 3 BTEC Extended Diploma in Sport and Football course. The course will be delivered at the Etihad Stadium in their state-of-the-art teaching and training facilities. The course focuses on a variety of different topics. We've got anatomy and physiology, just all about the body, we've got sports coaching, obviously, uh, leadership, but then it diversifies into sports nutrition, uh, psychology of sport, uh, talent ID and performance analysis. We coach the lads and girls three days a week, so we do Mondays, Tuesdays, uh, Thursday mornings, uh, two hour sessions, 9.30 to 11.30. Uh, it's all football based, but it's uh, all to a sort of similar to in the classroom. It's all to perfect us. So we've got passing, turning, shooting, whatever the team needs to work on. Um, we'll work on that throughout the course of the week. And, uh, every morning the yes, train is a great atmosphere with the coaches and the lads, the band, the club. You have been for a while a lot, so we're definitely training. I think it's fair to say that the best facility is Europe. So uh, we, literally anything that you can think of that we have, uh, it's available for you. So you've only got to look behind us. Uh, to see the facilities that we're using today. Uh, yesterday we went in and used the, uh, the indoor door, which is the facilities that Patrick Vieira uses with the, the under 21s and the, we use the equipment that the first team used. So we, facility wise, it's absolutely top end, there's, there's nowhere better. For, for like the change rooms and the showers, just better than anything. Everything, so can't take what you're having really. It's amazing, it's amazing. Like, you get to see all the facilities and the best there. Uh, you've got players that you can see around you. And, uh, tell that they're enjoying it so it just makes you want to go on and achieve what they're achieving also. So that you can't complain at this amazing. Probably the best facilities in the world football wise. Um, 200 million pound I think we spent on it and get to use it three times a week before even if you have a game. Yes God, yes God. The course is also available to girls, continuing the rapid growth of women's football in the UK. Now you've seen it like World Cup and stuff like that, I guess it gets you more into it because you're more TV and more advertisement, so it makes you more aware of football. I mean, we've had women players, we've seen, the girls have seen them women play the rugby training, so I think a couple of our players play for the City girls anyway, under 17s. So, um, yeah, they're looking at them a lot. But you've got, uh, like I said, you see the players knocking around, so when you see them uh, training and the youth squad and everything, you just think, oh, well, that could be me if uh, I push myself. So it really gives you that uh, sense of ambition to want to go and do that. Just on quick. That would have been fantastic in terms of the educational side of things. Um, we work really closely together, so in terms of meeting, we meet once a week um, with the tutors from Popwood to discuss the learners, how they're getting on, not only on the pitch, but also in the classroom. Students on this course can expect to receive up to 14 hours per week of quality coaching and training, whilst also working towards accredited further education qualifications. But you don't have to be a big wearer or a Vincent company, you've just got to come down, um, be able to play, get on with the, the lads and the coaches that are involved in the in the groups and um, ensure that obviously your grades are in the, in the right areas because for us really the main, the main side of it is the, is the educational side, that's the whole point of the course. This course has been developed to meet the expanding employment opportunities within the sports industry. A lot of students want to go to university um, to specialise and forge a career that way um, but some students are actually gaining careers as sports coaches, sports development officers, um, teaching assistants so there's a wide variety of what we what you go on to. We're setting up a foundation degree course um, for people that have done this course outside uh, people. So that's, I'm hoping to get on that one, so I'm hoping to become a coach or uh, get involved with the that way. When's that it? No. Oh my day! Oh my day! Before I started, I wanted to become a professional, but I thought well, there was no chance, so I never really pursued it. But now I started here, I'm doing the trials in June, I'm just sitting here to hope I'll get to there. It's like joining, you've got more chance of getting it because you'll be more involved around here. We offer the guys volunteer hours, so come along, do a little bit of volunteering, maybe go out and get the coaching badges, um, and hopefully develop a career in sport for them. Anyone interested in doing sport or in football, then, uh, definitely mention this to us.